Making cheesecake in the microwave is such an easy way to make a fast individual dessert. All you need to do is start by melting the butter in a mug. Swirl the mug around so that the butter coats all of the sides. This will help prevent the cheesecake from sticking later on and make it easy to pop out. The butter is also going to be used for the graham cracker crust. Next, mash up some graham crackers with the back of a spoon or a measuring cup or really anything. You want to crush them so that they're fine crumbles. You can also buy graham cracker crumbs if you'd rather do that. Then pour the crumbs into the mug of the melted butter and stir them up. You're going to make a graham cracker crust that's super, super delicious. Once your crust is mixed, use the back of the spoon to press it down and pack it into the mug. Now you're going to make the cheesecake filling. So you're going to mash the cream cheese, sugar, and vanilla together. You want to mix it quite a bit so that you get all the cheesecake lumps out. You don't want to have any lumps or else the cheesecake might taste a little funny. You want everything to be blended in well, so stir it really, really good. Now, scoop the cheesecake batter into the mug, putting it on top of that graham cracker crust. Smooth it out a little with a spoon, or you can just bang the mug on the counter to make it really nice and smooth. You want it to be smooth so that it bakes evenly. Now it's time to bake. You're gonna pop that cheesecake into the microwave for five minutes. You do wanna put your microwave on half power. So use that setting to lower the power of your microwave and cook the cheesecake slowly. Set it for five minutes and walk away. Once your cheesecake is baked, you can put it in the fridge for about an hour. You want it to get nice and cool so that it's easy to pop out of the mug. Cold cheesecake is also best. Now, you're going to take a knife or a small offset spatula and run it around the sides of the cheesecake. This is gonna help loosen it up. If you want, you can just eat the cheesecake straight out of the mug. So grab a spoon or a fork, whatever you'd like, and just dig in. I like to do this just to make it look like a nice presentation and a perfect individual cheesecake. Go all the way around, pushing down, making sure that you get that cheesecake crust out too. Once you've gone around the cheesecake, you're gonna flip it upside down onto a plate. Give it a good tap or a quick bang and it should pop right out. Then you're gonna flip the cheesecake over onto the plate that you'd want to use for serving. So put it on top, use both hands, grab both plates, flip it over, and then just remove the top plate. Ta-da, look at that cheesecake. It's perfect and it's perfect for one person. You can eat it right away. You can top it with some whipped cream, add some fruit, add some pie filling to the top, whatever you'd like, but it tastes really delicious as it is. If you wanna make the cheesecake look a little bit nicer, take that offset spatula or knife and run it all the way around the edges, smoothing it out just a little bit. This will make it look even better, but if it's just for you, don't even bother. Just dig right in. I hope you give this delicious microwave cheesecake a try. It is such a simple dessert and will satisfy any cheesecake craving. It tastes so incredible, you're never gonna know that it was baked in the microwave. I hope you guys found this helpful and definitely let us know if you try this recipe. We wanna know how much you love it too. Thanks everybody, enjoy!